they always enjoy it and they always love it. This community starts to build and they start to have such a deeper appreciation for dance. They support each other and they're understanding that it's a language, it's a form of expression, it's a part of literacy. Like we've infused it into so many other parts of our learning. The biggest thing is making them feel comfortable and confident that they can move and that we don't have to be perfect and I'm not going to make them spin on their toes, though now they want to spin on their toes. It means to me to express myself and to show that who you really are. It makes me feel calmness, relaxedness, happiness, or all the madness and sadness is out of me. When I dance, it just, it's gone. We are so fortunate that Pinkham's been a part of Sharing Dance um, for now two years and I can honestly say like starting off in the program, uh, students kind of had this attitude as like, I don't dance, dance isn't cool, you know I'm not doing that, it's going to make me look feel silly and that has completely changed and I can honestly say we've done Sharing Dance with two totally separate groups of kids and they always enjoy it. So as far as um, students at the beginning of the year, we have a couple fellows who have higher needs, autism for one, and they had some outbursts or they just refused to participate at the beginning of the year. However, two weeks ago, one of our boys hopped up and knew the entire dance and was teaching everybody the entire dance with counts, full emotion, right and left cues taught beyond what I had taught yet. And now he is the leader for the group, is the rest of the group is so supportive. And they are high-fiving him and they are so happy that he is so confident and taking that role. So they stand back and they go, okay, what arm is it? And they're learning from him. And they're so supportive. So it's a huge community thing. And just enjoy embracing the day together as a huge group.